All right, we're going through a heat wave. You gotta have something cool. We're gonna make some Dole Whips today. I have six ounces of frozen pineapple. I just buy the Superstore frozen pineapple chunks. If you have a scale, you can measure it. Otherwise, in these one serving cups, about this much, maybe a cup and a half-ish in there. And we're gonna add in half a cup of pineapple juice. So I just buy whatever one you can get, pineapple juice, you can get no-name, different brands. This was the one that was in stock when I went. You can make it with milk or a coconut milk, but it's much smoother and creamier if you use ice cream. Now you can also maybe use like a coconut ice cream if you need to go dairy-free. I just got vanilla ice cream. I just put it in a measuring cup so I knew how much. It's about half a cup of ice cream that we're gonna put in here. And we're gonna blend this in our, in my Ninja here. And I'm gonna blend it for about 30 seconds until it's all smooth. So I'm not gonna video the actual blending because it's gonna be very loud. So we'll stop the video here and I'll mix that up and I'll show you what this looks like. All right, we're just gonna do 30 seconds. seconds you want to just make sure there's no chunks that are in left in there and it's not coming down nice and thick with the ice cream it's very creamy you can put this in a bag and you can um, put a nice fancy tip on and put it in a cup to make it look like a real dough whip with the uh, spiral I just find if you do that if you would put it in a bag and you would squeeze it into a bowl and get your nice little swirl your hands are warm and it's gonna melt much quicker so I just find, put it in a cup and I just happen to have a nice little Mickey Mouse cup here because you know Dole Whips are very famous in Disneyland. But just look at that nice creamy, it's so yummy and refreshing. This is a great summer treat. Pick up your ingredients and make this for the during this heat wave. Fantastic. And I have the recipe right here. And of course you can multiply this recipe so it fits in a bigger blender. This is just my nice one cup serving that I have for my mix, my blender. But of course, I might, I might have to share this one because it makes actually a nice big serving. So we'll see, maybe I'll share it, maybe I won't. Uh, Mama left the room. <laughs>